Hi guys, it's Saturday, May 4th. Um, the Lord shared this word with me. I know I've been debating back and forth with people, and it, I know that it, it sometimes it's just sometimes hurtful, and you get very discouraged. And the Lord shared this word with me. So hopefully everybody that puts messages out and puts... Um, you know, puts their heart out there, will listen to this message because the Lord. Um, um, he, he gave me this word this morning. When my messengers listen to the accusers, they shrink back. You must not shrink back, my children. Keep feeding the flock with reassurance that they will be protected in times of trouble. Your messages are like manna from heaven delivered to a hungry flock, a flock that is trying to make sense out of the unpredictable world around them. My sheep are tired. They, are, they need refreshing. They need these messages of assurance. I say again to you, my messengers, do not come down from the wall. Keep watching and relaying my messages to those who have ears to hear. There will come scoffers and there will even come brethren that wrongly attack you. Do not be swayed. Satan and his minions are desperately trying to keep my messages from reaching my weary children. Feed on my word for strength. Nourish, nourish the Holy Spirit within you with my word. Remain faithful and you will be rewarded in my kingdom. Bring my messages boldly now. As things begin to unfold, keep watch on the signs and report what you see. This has all been written of and much prophecy is being fulfilled. This is not the time to shrink back. Just listen for me and feed my messages to those who have ears to hear. Many will come against you. You will be hated. For my sake, you must press forward and focus on me and the job I have given you. Give this message to my messengers. And I just feel like there's some people out there that are afraid to put out messages that seem to be receiving them but are not putting them out. So um, please start posting anything that you're hearing from the Lord. Um, I think it's what he wants us to be doing right now. Um, have a good weekend. Thanks.